All right, everyone, welcome back to Brezlev Efrat here at Shira David Bo Hashem, Erev Shabbos Kodesh, Parsha Kisisa. Ah, very uh, difficult Parsha. A lot of beautiful things in the Parsha, but uh, it's a very difficult Parsha. <laughs> right, we have, uh, we have, we talk about the Machsuz Shekel, the Kior, right, washing our hands for the Kohanim, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> and, uh, and, 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 uh, okay, Bo, what? They keep leaving about the feet, though. Why do they leave about the feet? Nice things, nice yeah. things. Bo Hashem. All right, so now we're going to continue learning Lukut HaLochas, Bo Hashem. We're in Hilchas Birchas Hashacha, Halacha Hey. Today we're up to Samach Aleph, and of course we learn for the well-being of our chayalim, our soldiers, and our chitufim, the, uh, our captives, and, and Hashem should help them all. Uh, the chitufim should be rescued, and uh, the chayalim should uh, win this war real quick. And knock out our enemies, and everyone should go home safely. Amen, amen, amen. Ay Hashem, please hear our tefillas. Okay, so uh, the Rebbe is going to we're going to we're learning now. Sama Chalav, this is amazing. The Rebbe is going to explain to us now the whole idea of the Bein Shema the Ratzon. Oh, good morning, Rabbi Simcha. He has he have his book ready. For, okay, good. Oh Hashem. And uh, here we go. La klal ki atzadik bechinas meisha oisik la alois mishmad the whole idea of the tzadikim, which uh, which the tzadik that we always refer back to as meisha rabbeinu, right? His idea, whole his his whole Indian is to raise people up from shmad to rotzin to bring them back closer to Hashem to the rotzin Hashem. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's what the tzadikim do. Okay, Shmad means um, when someone leaves the religion. They say they Shmad themselves. They, 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 in other words, if someone decides they want to be Chas Roshalm, they don't want to be a Jew anymore. Right? So then that's called Shmad. Right? That's what that means. That's Shmad. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't know. What? Destruction. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lashmid, Lashmid means to destroy, because the guy is destroying himself, <laughs> right? <laughs> He's destroying his soul, right? Okay. Yeah. yeah. And what you said about the tzaddikim, that's becoming really real to me, because really, I couldn't be where I am today without learning from the tzaddikim. That's it. That's exactly the, the, the whole sparring, point. All the sparring, everything is from the tzaddikim. That's the, that's the whole point. That's exactly they, right. They translate smart as uh, yeah, he destroys his nisham. That's really, yeah, it's the, to destroy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not. It's not a good thing. It's not. But so the so, so the tzaddik is always trying to bring those people back. He's trying to bring them back, right? But he says, look at this here. We all have to do this on our levels. You see that? Let's see what that means. Look what it says there. Shezed Sarek Gam Kol Echad. That's you and me, everyone. Everyone. Lefi Madregosa. Ki Afilu HaKisherim Kishesorim. Lefom Me Achri Hashem Yisbarach. Nech Shav Lavoy Dezor. So you can have right, righteous people, right? Good guys, right? That are serving Hashem. Good guys that are, that are doing the right thing. But sometimes, you know, they fall away. When they fall away, that's considered like Avod Dezor. That's considered on a level. It's not mamish. No, no, no. Let's not let's not get carried away. This is not yeah. not mamish. They think I didn't serve a dime. Okay, he didn't do that. But any time we said that a person does something contrary to Hashem's will, that's an aspect of avodazar, right? Hashem <laughs> says do this, and I do something. If I Hashem do something else, so then I'm doing something contrary to Hashem. So that's an aspect of avodazar, right? Well, I don't know. That I want to agree with that. You don't want to agree with it? Because you keep telling us that the Yetzirah is there yeah. to push us away. Yeah, yeah. And, and so we can come back. Yeah. So therefore, it's not about a czar. It's just I'm falling so I can rise I up. I understand. But when you're looking at it from the outside, it We're looks... We're judging like, it. No, I understand. I understand. But that's an aspect of... He's explaining what it really is, though. If the, we the, stay there. You, you just, just stay there. What's it? Shuhu bechina shmad rachman l'tzlan. Right, but we, don't, we, we want Hashem to protect us that we don't have to deal, deal with these things. Right. Okay, but unfortunately, as, we, as the Baal Shem Tov taught us, 
al aposik v'satem v'avadetem elihim acherim. Right, if you turn away and you serve other gods, right? So the so, so the Baal Shem Tov said taught. Okay. Uh, this was the the, the Reb, this was Rabbi Nachman's great grandfather, right? <coughs> right. Okay, he taught this lesson here. If you turn away from Hashem, that's an aspect of Shema. That's an aspect of, of, of doing something against what Hashem wants. Right? Now, even someone, that's someone that went a little bit away, right? Right. Right? For, for a short time, hopefully, right? But now someone that went away and he went away distant. He's really distant. Al kulam megiyim rachamei hatzadik. The rachamonis of the tzadik comes and will help, can help every one of them, no matter where they are. So if we believe in the kayach of the tzadikim, which we're supposed to, right? Yep. That's what we talk about in our Shmon Esrei, right? Neshalem b'tachlat tzadikim. We have to believe in the tzadikim. Vayaminu b'ashem uve Moshe Avdo, right? We say that in our davening, right? Vayaminu b'ashem uve Moshe Avdo. We believed in Hashem and, and the Moshe. And we have to believe in the tzadikim, right? So the, tz- the, the rachamanis of the tzadik will go so far. Because again, don't forget, the tzadik through his righteous acts, right, all his life, the tzaddik is working all the time. He has a lot, a lot of mitzvahs. He has a lot of, uh, a lot of, a lot of mice and taivim that he did all his life, right? So all of that is there. All of that's there to help him, right? All of that's there to help him to be able to reach every single person. And the tzaddik can want to reach everyone. To take us all from the idea of shmad to bring us up to rotsan. This is what the whole idea is. The Iker, Ayadei Koyach Pidyan, all through the idea of Pidyan, right? Remember we learned about the Pidyan, right? The, the Pidyan, the redemption, ransom. <laughs> it still says ransom over there? Mm-hmm. Wow, okay. It didn't learn. It didn't learn. <laughs> it's a silly, it's a, it's, a, it's a silly word in translation, I think. Yeah, there was the power of ransom. Which yeah, I, I believe that's a silly, so. that's a silly translation for it. Why, why, why ransom? Right, okay, anyway, it's a, it's a pigeon, it's, it's a, he, he can get it from that place of pigeon, right? From that place of pigeon, which is the highest place, right? The place of pigeon is that, is the Rotson Elyon, right? That Metzach Rotson. Metzach Rotson. Vayadei Bechinas Metzach through the Bechin of Metzach Rotson. And that's where the Tzaddikim go, they go to that high place. And they could pull the Rachmanis, pull the pigeon out for anybody. But you just have to want to believe in the tzaddik. And then the tzaddik can help you. Unbelievable. <laughs> He can take his, he can go to that high, high place, and then he can go all the way down to the lowest place where those Jews are found. Lemata, lemata, ad shafilu, ad shafilu becholam madregas atachtoinus maoid, afilu beesa kisrin de mistabusa. Right, even in the ten uh, 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 domains of impurity, the ten means it literally means the ten crowns of impurity. Right, it means the ten domains of impurity. Right, we know there are ten spheres of holy spheres. Right. Right? So on the other side, you have the ten domains of impurity, right? The opposite, right? So the tzaddik can go to even those places because he's high, he's connected to the highest place of Kedusha. So he can go down and send down to those places to pull up those people. Unbelievable, right? Magia harotza in hakodesh lechol hanefoshesh nuflu l'sham all those poor souls that fell to those places, the Rachmanis of the tzaddik can get there. All those people are screaming, "There's no God, and there's no, there's no, and there's no, and it's all over." This, all of that, those guys, he can help all of them, and Hashem will help the tzaddik help all of them. And then don't forget, in those places, right? In those places, when they, when they turn on the spark, right? When he turns on the spark, he lights the neshama of that per- each, each one of those souls. Then they desire to come back to Hashem. 
They have that isufim. They have those desire. They want to come back to Hashem. Ki ilu hanayflim miyoid iefsha lahachiyosam ulashivam ki ima yedei rotsan. This is the secret here. See, Rav Nassim is teaching us. It's amazing. See, when you learn Lakute Alochas, right? Rav Nassim is giving us the real secrets of the Zaya, secrets of, of, of the way the world works, right? Really to understand this. If you want to touch somebody, you want to get somebody, and you want to help that person that fell away, you have to go up to that place of Ratzon, the place of Pidyan, and you have to attach yourself to that place in order to help that person. Because that's where it can happen from. You see what he says here? Right? Look what he says. It's impossible to give them life. Right? They went to Shmad. Right? They went to that place of destruction. Right? It's impossible to give them life. The opposite way. Right? right, so we have the Metzach HaRotzon, and then we brought down the Pasuk in, in Yirmiya, where Yirmiya brought a Pasuk of the Metzach Isha Zona. Right, the same way the lady of ill repute has no, has no remorse, and she's so brazen at what she does, right? Right, she does, it's very brazen, very, very brazen. Right, but that's on the opposite side. That's on the lowest side of the, other, the opposite spectrum. Right, the highest spectrum is Metzach Arotzen. The lowest one of the ten, 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 ten uh, domains of impurity is the Isha Zona. The Metzach Isha Zona. Gam Haim. Look at this. Gam Haim. Yes, Oiru Vishtaikiku Berotzen Toi Vichazak Vashem is Baruch Ache Yalu Oisa Mishmad Lerotzen. You see that? There's hope for everybody. That's what it is. The rabbi says, Ain Shum Yayas, well, don't give up. Never give up on anybody. There's a way to get help every single person. Mm-hmm. We can do it. It's through connecting to the Ratz and Elyon. You have to connect up to this whole thing, connect it to the Shema Yisrael, like we learned, right? That's how we can, we can do that. It's on Shabbos by Mincha, Ravid the Ravid. That's how we can access the, the, the Ratz and the, the, the Metzach HaRatz and, right? These are the times, right? All right. So the problem I have, the challenge I have with this, the, let's use the prostitute to examine it. She doesn't know about all these things. Doesn't matter what she knows. It knows using the example that she's the, 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 a person like that is very brazen what they're doing. They, well, she has no rem- she has no, re- no 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 busha, nothing. I understand. My my point is yeah. that she, to her maybe it isn't brazen. It's just what she's learned is her way to survive in this world. That's fine. But we, we don't care about her. We're learning about the concept. Forget the person. No, but I'm, I'm trying to focus on the concept that there are so many people that are, I mean, I, for the longest time, was unaware of anything I understand. about Judaism. Okay. And I was really, I was pretty low. No, 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 no. no. But no, I wasn't no. there because I knew no, anything no, no, that no, I didn't no, no, know. No, 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 okay. Mordechai, okay, okay. L- 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 one second here. If Nelson's teaching us a concept that if there's a person that fell down to a low place. How do we scoop this person out? How do we get him out of that? How do we get, what's the, what's the procedure that we can rescue that person? What's the procedure? Okay. So the procedure is I have to go to, to the ruts and alien, which is the opposite of that one. Right. And then I can go down in that place and help that soul. But does he pray for them when he's up in the red zone? Because yeah, you, know, you can. That's what we. Th- because okay. if you go down, hey, Mordecai, they, remember may, I, they may not. Hey, Mordecai, to remember, them. I told you the only thing we could do for people is pray. we can pray for them, right? Right. So that's how we do. But when you went, now we're learning. When you pray for them, you have to pray for them from that place of Rotson. Right. That's where you have to go to. You have to be in that place of pigeon in order to pray for that soul, or or pray to a tzaddik who. Can help no, no, you don't soul. pray to no, it, Sadiq. No, but no, you don't pray to it, I pray to God that he'll get That's it. That's a whole by itself. You okay. don't pray. So I'll pray to you God. talk to it, Sadiq. You don't pray to no, it, Sadiq. You only God. pray to God. But I pray to God that he'll send it Sadiq down ask, to get this You person. can ask the Sadiq to pray for you. You can do that. You can ask the Sadiq to pray for you, but you don't dive into it, Sadiq. We don't no, do that. I understand. Okay, but that's very important to understand. Everyone needs to understand that. We believe in the Sadiq. You can talk to the tzaddik like you would talk to a, a, a lawyer, right? You don't, your lawyer, you don't pray to the lawyer. 
You talk to the lawyer. You want to get yeah. ideas. You want to you want to understand what's he going to do for the K, right? So that's how you talk to the tzad. Yeah. I'm just giving. That's not. It's not exactly that way. But I'm just giving an example where where, where a person depends on his lawyer, right? He's got. He has a big case against him, right? He's depending on his lawyer, right? Here, the guy has a big case against him, up on the, and the court's up on high. He needs a tzaddik. That's his lawyer, right? Okay. All right, we got it? Okay, so this is the concept, okay? So you have to go up to the highest place, right? You attach yourself, you get, you, you, you get the pidgin from there, and then you can go to the lowest place in order to, to light the... That's how people come back. That's how we get people to come back. When they go down to the lowest place, what do they do when they get there? The tzaddik or... He can, he can, uh, he can, he can help the, the person to realize that Hashem is there also. I don't think that Hashem abandoned you in this place. Hashem is there with you also. Again, we learned Hashem is everything of the world. He's everywhere, right? Hashem is everywhere. The question is, can you access Hashem from that place? Does the person know that there's Hashem in that place? Yes. Well, so the tzaddik comes to show him that the tzaddik, Hashem is in that place too. He's there. He's there with you. You could turn to him from that place. So they have to believe in God when they're down there to be pulled out. Well, if you don't believe, that's what no, no, that's what the tzaddik helps. The tzaddik helps the person recognize that he's in in this in the shol taktiyas, that low, low place. Hashem is there with him. He's not there himself. You follow? Hashem is there with him. And when the person recognizes, wow, Hashem is with me, he didn't abandon me. I thought I'm here myself. Hashem is way up there. He's not here with me here. What I'm relating to is like, if I meet someone and they don't believe in God. Yeah. Yeah. There's not much, all I can do is pray for them. I relate to nothing I can do for them. That's right. Because the more they, you talk to them, the more you talk to them. The more you push they, them away. They, no, no, no. They, they're just going to, they're just going to get stronger. What they, They're going to fight you more. Right. So, why doesn't that happen down below? I mean, if I'm, if I'm down in the Shmad because I don't believe in God, yeah. so what if a tzaddik comes and tells me God's here with me? No, no, okay. It's, you don't, maybe there's something I miss you, just you, trying you, to really you, get you, it. You, no, no, you don't believe in God, right? Okay, the person doesn't believe in God that he's down there. But when he, when he meets the tzaddik, right, mm -hmm. the tzaddik will, 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 will help him understand that. But it doesn't even have to be that he has to meet the tzaddik there. The tzaddik can just connect to his neshama. Right. You understand? And then the neshama okay. starts to, his own neshama starts to okay. be awakened. So there's From a, inside. His there's neshama some, is, yeah. is awakened inside. So there's some kind of spiritual way this is happening. Yes. It's not necessarily that I personally, my brain, know that it's happening. Yeah, it's a spiritual, it's a spiritual thing. thing, right, right. Okay. You're making the person have a new feeling. New feeling. A new feeling to feel Hashem. Hashem is giving him a new thought. Hashem, a new thought that he's, no, 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 he's, that, that is Hashem in this place. You follow that? You understand? Yeah. That's what happens. And then the person's thinking, wow, I'm not a, I, I didn't, uh, Hashem is with me here. That means I can connect to Hashem. Yeah. I thought I'm here all by my, myself. It's amazing, right? If you think about it, right? The person can think that he's so lost. He's lost. I, I, there's no way I can come back. Why do a lot of people don't do tshuva? They think they're so far away. They can't do tshuva. I did so many things wrong. Look, look, look at the example of Elisha ben Avuya, right? Right, Acha, right? Rav Meir's Rebbe, right? Yeah. He was talking about a person that was Rav Meir, Rav Meir Balanes, right? Rav Meir, his Rebbe. Let's think about it. He was a great person right. if he was his rabbi, right? Right. right? But, but he, he fell away. He fell away. He didn't understand this concept. It said yeah. there was a baskal that came out. Shuvu banim, shuvu chutz mayacher. Everyone come back except for you. Except for you, yeah. <laughs> he heard a baskal. Right? He heard a, that's what the Gemara said. He heard a baskal. That means, he, that means a, a, an announcement came out of heaven that said everyone can turn back to Hashem, but you have gone too far. You can't come back. That now, but now we're learning that really that's not true. And you don't have to listen to the Basco. The Torah is not loy The right. Torah is not in heaven. Right. The Torah is down here. Right? Loy it's, it's It's down here. So down here, down here, you understand? Down here, we can always turn back to Hashem because Hashem is everywhere here. So it seems like the tzaddikim are not 
doing their job very well. Oh, no, Chasmus, why are you saying that? We have so many people, so many Jews that are. That well, don't we, we did, God we did learn. Well, we did learn the other day that Sadiq can take upon themselves inflictions because they say they feel they feel that way. Yeah. They feel that things are happening because they're not doing enough for the Jewish people. Right. So they'll take upon themselves different inflictions and different things. All right. We, okay. okay. But then again, that's on their level. That's nothing to do with. We're learning here now. Well, I'm mad because there's so many people that don't believe in God okay, okay, that are living. Okay. Of Mordechai, so you have to dive in for them. Okay. okay. That's it. That's it. <laughs> that's okay. all you can do. That's all we can do. Thank you for the reminder. Davin, no, Davin for them, and Davin yeah. to, for the tzaddikim as well, that they should have more power, power. to do what they have to do. To That's all. Huh? To <laughs> <laughs> he wants to come to the minion real early. <laughs> give, okay. give them books. Give, give them literature. They might pick it up. Yeah. I don't even think I can give someone a book. I think that's still coming from me. I think I still need to just pray for them. Mm-hmm. Coming from the tzaddik, if you give, if you give, if you give, uh, very no, no, but he's saying, he's saying, no, no, but he's saying, yeah, okay, you okay. Know, doing that, it's all right. It's not for you, you know. But uh, I've found that I've given the small books, big books. They don't look at it right right away, and two years later they yeah. look at it. I mean, you just yeah, don't, yeah, no. yeah. They put it on the bookshelf, That's and then true. one day they're looking at, oh, let me see what that says. Yeah. I've even bought books that I haven't looked at for two years. I said, I have this. Right, I do. I do too. Yeah. In fact, that's how I came back to uh, came to Breslau. Uh, 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 Michelle gave me uh, a little book, and and I put it on the shelf. And one day, a few years later, I picked it up, and that was it. That Look was at that! What is this? I wonder who prayed for me. What is this? And luckily, I wrote his name down. It could have been your grandfather. Mm-hmm. Your yeah, grandmother. Yeah, it could have been. Yeah. It could have been. Who yeah, knows? Who knows? Yeah. I want to we thank them. We don't know. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. Don't worry. Whoever so, you are, I thank you for what you've, how you've helped me. <laughs> Unbelievable. See that? Okay. All right. Good. Be shtayku, be yisayru, be shtayku, beratzah, natay, vechazak, lachevit, ad sheyala oisa mishmad leratzah, until they can come away from that shmad and come, they can also come back to the ratzah. And listen, every time like we do today, where we, we're, we're doing all of these beautiful things, by like Klai Yisrael is doing all these chassad, right? we're all together, we have our achdas, and people around, all Jews all around the world are, are, are davening, they're saying to heal him, they, they, they're sending things for chayat, they, 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 it's, it's amazing things going on. These are all things that are helping us. This is what's yeah. going to help, they, they, these are all the things that are helping the situation. Aliyah has more than doubled since October 7th. Okay. And it's tripled from France or okay. somewhere in Europe. Well, it's it's, it's, well, yes. And, you know, listen, the French people, That's myself, just, I'm telling you, I spoke, to, I, I know a lot of people in France and they, and they just have some kind of special glasses they wear. <laughs> they wear special glasses because, you know, they, they just wear, they, no, it's, it's, it's wonderful. Viva la France. You know, <laughs> they love their country. <laughs> but there's chaos there. Chaos. Well, apparently some people are waking up. Yeah, I know. Yeah, well, Thank God. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The people, the people are waking up. Oh, yes, yes. Okay. Okay. Kizaya Dua. Look at the way it says. Kizaya Dua. This is known. This is a known thing. The lower someone fell down, the lower level he fell down to. Right? The, 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 the lower you have fallen is the, is the, you have to go up higher in order to be able to go to descend that high. In other words, in other words. that low, you mean? Descend that low, right? Descend. So the higher you go, yeah, yeah, the lower yeah. you can go. You can go higher. If you go up to the highest place, you can come down to the lowest place. Oh, thank you very much. You need the strongest me- medicine when you're in the sickest. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I brought a couple of cookies for you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm kidding. Shezeh v'china she'ikar ha'tikva l'chol elu hurak ha'yedei ha'pidyo and ha'elyon and the whole idea of the pit, the whole idea that all these people that fell down to these low, low, low places, the only way you're going to really help them is through this idea of pigeon. They need a pigeon, they need a, a redeem, they need to be redeemed from wherever they are. They have to be pulled out from there using pigeon. Where does a pigeon come from? Rotsanelli, Metzacha Rotsan. 
which is the opposite of the Metzach Isha Zayna that we said, right? right. So I'm going to show my ignorance. Is there one in the, in, is there a, one of the blessings in the Amida associated with that? Of what? The Ratzel? With, with uh, what we're talking about. No, 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 no. They, no, no, we, no, no. This, is, this is connected to the seven blessings of Krishna. Of the of the of the Shema, the seven blessings, the four blessings okay. at night, and then the three blessings in the morning. That's seven, right? We learned that, right? Because the set, why seven? Because the the uh, the the Metzach Hatachton up on high, right? The Metzach Hatachton is no, also known as the Zer Anpin. Whenever you speak here, the word Zer Anpin, that's talking about the lower Metzach, right? We're teaching us deep concepts here. Like in Shalosh Shulis, we talk about the Zer Anpin, right? So what's the Zerampin? Zerampin is the lower Metzach, where you have the 24 courthouses, right? All right? So when we do the Shema, then we're actually... Yeah, the Shema is what gets... Right, right. Making redemption for... Again, again, the Shema. When we do the Shema in the morning, right? So we first say, Yotzer Ma'oros. Hashem, you created the luminaries. We established that Hashem creates everything. Hamachadesh betuvei bechol yon tamid. Hashem, you re- you created the world again today anew. It's brand new. When I do that, and I, I recognize it's all Hashem, it's all Hashem. And then when I say Hashem Yisol Hashem Elakenu Hashem Echad, and I recognize that I say the the Hashem is Echad, He's one, right? And the Ches is Ches. Why Ches? There are seven firmaments in this world. Right? Seven firmaments and this world. Okay? That's the ches and the echad. And the dalit is in all four directions. So when I, when, I, when I recognize that Hashem is the only one that has any power in this world to do anything, it's only Hashem, that's how I can connect to that metzah harotza. And then when I do that, I am praying for in some way helping people who have fallen. You can't, yes, yes, you can, right? And we learned in Sitzes when we say, right? we say that's why it says you're supposed to take your Sitzes in your hand, right? right? Right. When you say those words. So when you do that, remember that Sitzes has four corners to it, right? So you take the four corners together, you want to grab all the Jews that are in all the four okay. corners of the earth, you and want to bring, bring them it. back to the together as a unity. That's why you bring all the tzitzis all together. Remember, we learned that in tzitzis. Yeah. Right, okay, right. And so we should have our intention. Now we're learning, but then, right, so we learned that concept, but now we're learning how, what's the, the technique and how to do it. So I said, we want to get them all back. You have in mind to get them back. Then you say, Shema Yisrael Hashem Elekeinu Hashem Echad. Oh, Echad. Oh, now I'm at the place of Rotson. Now I'm in the place of Pidyon. Now we can help all of those people. You understand? And we help them by praying for them at yes. that time? Yeah, yeah you have, have to have in mind. mind. Have them in them mind. In? Have them in mind, yes. Yeah. Yeah. You're, you're, you're also praying for yourself. Yeah. I mean... Sure you pray. I mean... I mean you're the model. I mean, you have to be there. Well, of course, of course, you, you, well, you're, you're saying the words, yeah. but, but, but again, you know, right? If you dab in for your friend, right. then you'll be answered first, right? That's what they say, right? If two people have the same problem, right? right. So if they say, okay, I'll dab in for you and you dab in for me, right? right? So then I'll help you and you'll help me, right? Have you heard that concept before, and, right? And we've all got a problem with distancing from Hashem. I mean, uh, we, we all have, have a, we yes. We all have that at yeah. different times. Di- That's different, right. Different measures, but we all have it. Right, 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 right. If two, well, let's say two people have a problem with Parnassa, right? Right, let's say they have a, they, they're having trouble earning their ends meet, right? Mm. Right, two people, right? So you say, listen, I'm having a problem, you're having a problem. I'll, I'll daven for you, and you daven for me. Right, that's what Chazal say. Right. Right? Right? All right. right? And this guy may need a thousand, and this guy may need a hundred thousand. It doesn't matter, Hashem. I'm, I'm, I'm saying. Yeah, I'm saying. it doesn't matter, to Hashem. There's no. There's, it's, 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 Hashem has all the money in the world. It's nothing. It's right, nothing. Right, right. So there's a couple more zeros after the one. What's the big deal? Right. Or after a, a nine? Who cares? What's the difference? What's it? To Hashem, it's nothing. I mean, even today, think about it. What, what is it today? What is money today in this world? What is it? What is it? Paper? Paper. What, what, what is it? Paper. What is money? It's backed by what? Nothing. Right? Money used to be, right? The dollar used to be backed by gold. Oh, then it was backed the, by silver. Now it's backed by, by dung. 
right? <laughs> the uh, American uh, credit. Yeah, which is which is a big pile of dung. Yeah. Right, that's all it is, right? What, 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 what is it? It's it's a it's it's Nothing. it's. Yeah. Why? 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 No, but it's true, <laughs> right? China owns most of America, right? Yeah. If China would call in the debt on on America, they 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 put up the Chinese flag on the on the White House, right? Right. <laughs> I think you already so, have it up there. Yes. Yeah, so, <laughs> <laughs> so what? Why are they really? What is it? Okay. It's all. It's all. Hush, don't you understand? I'm getting there. Okay. Good. Maybe. Okay. We're, we're trying. We're all trying. Right. We're all trying. Well, does everyone agree with this thing with the money, right? Well, really, what is it today? If I, if I was coming here every day, I'd be lost. No, 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 but Bamet, really, Yossi, do you, do you think money has any value today? People think it has a value. That's why it has a value. But really, what is it? It's true. I, I, it's, it's hard I learned, to... I learned, a, I learned a great thing about money. Uh, it said a poor guy will have all this money, whatever he has, it's in his pocket. Mm -hmm. The richer you are, the further the money is from you. Yeah, see that? You're, you know, it, it, it's, in, it's in Switzerland. I'm, you know, I mean, or whatever, you whatever don't even it is. See right. it. You don't even see it. It's just yeah. numbers on a piece of paper. You don't see I it. don't even see it on a paper, today. it's you on your screen. It. <laughs> right. Right. You look on your computer screen, your phone screen, so you see nothing. Yeah. Well, yes, he's still got a uh, The crimp. They have no cash on them. That's true. The billionaires I'm with, they have no. I, 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 I'm lending no the money all the time, all day long. They, they, the grandkid goes, "Zadi, can I can, can I have a little ice cream?" The kid. Doesn't he doesn't have a credit card. He doesn't have a credit card. No, he doesn't. Whatever. They don't have to. Then I'll take care of it. I'll take care of it. I'll take care of it. They don't have a. We're not a checkout. They don't even have nothing. Wow. They, they don't have, I always wow. come in and. and wow. Cash. Yeah. Well, that's why they always have money, because they always have a mooch and a mooch and yeah. of everyone else. So they keep their money. I see, I'm so rich, right? It's, a, it's an image. The guy probably doesn't have two, two, he probably doesn't have two nickels to rub together. But everyone thinks he's so rich. Oh, oh, so we'll buy you an ice cream. <laughs> you couldn't do it, no cash. But, that's it, but you're right, that, that's how you know it's a big taiva, like, meaning taiva like, like a, what are the three big tigers? Which is you know, Rav Nachman speaks about all. Yeah, yeah, which yeah. Is, which is money, money, money. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, 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 and food. And yeah, food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need another cookie. I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> everything was fine. You didn't need to be a no cookie. Everything's fine, but all was fine. So, but, but there, there's an Indian of, of, of no, no he's a, great. This guy's no, great. There's an Indian of, 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 but it's a big idea that those particular three that he chose to talk about, how the dimion, the imagination in our brain, yeah. gets us to think that there's something greater there then, 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 than then, there then, really is. Yeah, yeah, there's yeah. something specifically about, oh, this, 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 if I only had this, you know, relationship and this woman and I was in this, oh boy, the, the pleasure would be so good. But it's, it's and if I only had this kind of money, and then this money, oh. If I only had this kind of money, oh. yeah. Then the money will then lead him to the women, to lead him to the food. Yeah, yeah. When you, you buy a car, you get all that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. Shazam. Okay, oh, <laughs> guys, 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 guys. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay. Shazam bechin as kids. Okay. So basically, the whole idea is we have to go up to the place of Pidyon, the place of Rotson, right? That high place in order to help anybody. That's what we have to attach our tefillahs to, to that place. When we attach our tefillahs to that place, when we're davening for people, we can have some effect. Okay? Now, okay. Now, v'zeh b'chines s'vira s'oymer shemenifin oymer s'oyrim m'shu b'chines bahamis. Right? We learned this before. Right, the whole idea, the Oymer Soirim, right, on the second day of Pesach, right, the Koyim would take the, uh, the, the, bar, the barley, right, which is bin, <laughs> right, and he'd wave it in the, all the directions. Why would he wave it in all directions? To show that this coarse thing here, this din, how am I going to be mamtik the din? I'm going to show that Hashem is really behind all the din. Hashem is behind everything, right? Because, it, w w listen, when a person does Averis, right, so he brings din upon himself, right? 
person does a sin, right? So then the, the judges in those 24 courthouses are angry. They issue judgment against him. But he brought the judgment upon himself by doing his sins. You understand? Right? He, he does the sin. He brings the judgment upon himself, right? But over here, what we're doing is we're showing that the din from this barley, right? The barley, wheat is chesed. Wheat is chesed. Wheat is, people eat wheat, right? That's, that's chesed. Barley is din, okay? So we take the din and we wave it in the four directions to show, right? And see, he does it in the six directions, right? To show that Hashem is everywhere. Hashem is in charge of everything. That's again, connecting back to the pidyon, right? To the rotson. Because I'm showing that the, yes, there's din. But Hashem is in charge of all of the din. Hashem is in charge of everything. How now watch what he din? says now. What? How is barley din? That's what the zoy is. Okay, oh. yeah. It, because it's a, it's it's a, it's a, it's what animals eat. It's not what the, what people uh, generally. It's not what people eat. Okay. So who minchas? Oh, konis la soita. Right. Okay. So here we have another thing. Right. Interesting thing here. Right. Which is who began znos shabai de ruach shtos. Yeah. Well, let's, let's talk about this for a second. So there were two times that we had the, uh, 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 a bar, they, you, we used this idea of barley. When did we use barley? On the second day of Pesach, right? When we're trying to mamtik the din, because we have to get through the sphere, right? There's another time when, a, when a, where you had an Isha Sota. What was an Isha Sota? It was a <coughs> woman that, that was warned not to be secluded with a certain individual, right? She right. was warned not to be secluded with a certain individual. And she was secluded with that individual, right? So now, how are they going to determine if she did something, uh, uh, if she if she did something illicit or not? How will they determine it? They They'll use the the, they go to the Kohen, something. right? The the, the May Sota, right? But what the part of the process? Yeah, we all know about the May Sota, the water, right? You write yeah. Hashem's name, erase it, put it in the in the water. She would have to drink it. But also, what they did was she, she also brought barley. Right, there was barley there also used. Okay, the same idea, the din, because she brought upon herself the din. Right, she did something, whether or not she did something, whether or not she did something illicit at that time when she was there, but she still was miyachin with that person. Right, she still secluded herself with this individual. That was din. Right, that's din. Right, we know there are, there are laws. You can't seclude yourself with with, with women. Right. Right. Okay. There's a story. Yeah. That Except because you can't get away if you've done it, you can't get away from it. So, a woman they want a husband accuse her woman, her wife of uh, messing around, and he wanted to go and get tested. She had a twin sister. She sent the twin sister to go, and because the twin sister didn't do anything, she drank the water. She was fine, you know, no big deal. And when she went back and she hugged her sister and kissed her, she, the woman who was, she died. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the Sota has been amazing. Yeah, I tell that story. story. Yeah. I, 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 I always take groups. You know, sometimes I'll tell that story often. I, in, 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 outside of Jerusalem, I'll always say, you know, if there's something, a ruins around the time of the second base, I'll make that shot. You know, because I heard that it was, in the, I heard it was outside of Jerusalem is when it happened. So I'll, I'll always yeah. tell that story. That, I don't know if it happened here in this house particularly, but here's a story. Of yeah, 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 yeah. Way, 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 you know, so. So he, he, to she me, the lesson she, fast one. she did. She did she pull a fast one. Yeah, yeah. She had it. She had it. And she was so happy. Uh, <laughs> she was so happy. We pulled, we pulled one on Hashem. And I kind of. <laughs> we, we pulled, pulled one, one on, on Hashem. Hashem. Yeah, we got the Kohen Gadol. We got him to scrape his name off. I drank it. The whole thing worked. The right. The whole shebang, right? To a T. <laughs> No, she said a little water in her mouth, whatever. Yeah, yeah but it, it's, a, it's a, wow. It's also a lesson. You had anything, you got your plan, it's yeah. all worked out. Turns out you were yeah, smarter yeah, than Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You can't We're not going to, not going to, no, no. You know, a lot of people have tried, but it doesn't work out, Right? Right, so in other words, the same idea. We fell down to our to our low place before Pesach, right? We go through the winter, everything, right? 
We, we just finished the weeks of Shavavim, right? But now we have a couple of weeks till, till Pesach, right? So whenever we fall down, right? So now we have to get that. When we get to Pesach, we want to get, we want to recognize it. We want to, we want to be mamtik the din. So we <laughs> take the, 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 the same idea, the same way the Isha Zona, this, this lady, the Sota, he did the same idea. Waved it, recognized it's all Hashem, right? That's how you mamtik the din. That's how your mom picked it in. Then if she, and then if she drank the water, and she was, she already was, she made, she fixed the din by bringing this iron, right? She brought, and they waved it around in all the directions, right? And then they recognize that it's Hashem. It's Hashem. She recognizes it's Hashem. So then she drinks the water. She's okay. If she, if she was, if she was innocent. Yeah. But she, either way, she wasn't innocent, right? Either way, the lady's not innocent, right? There were witnesses that saw her, Right, witnesses came and, and testified that they saw this lady secluded in this guy's room, right, or whatever, whatever it was, right, in this guy's house, in wherever it was. Yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. Ache bekoya zem anifin haoimer soirim lahamti katinim levata la ruach shtus bemasa behemis. Right. The Gemara says a person doesn't do anything wrong unless it comes into the person a ruach shtus. Right. If he has a a ruach of uh, some. Folliness, I don't know, how would you say Rosh Foolishness, Rosh Rosh. foolishness Foul. right? Folly, foolishness comes into, comes into the person's head, and then he, 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 he thinks for a second, right? We learned, we learned, where, where does that come from? The Kaya Hamedame, right? It comes from the Kaya Hamedame, right? The imagination, right? The person imagines, right? you see, right? The person imagines, if I have this, oh, oh it's going to be good. Oh, if I have that, oh, it's going to be good. Oh, it's imagination. What is it? It's just imagination, because you don't have it. So the guy's imagining, if I have this, I can get it, right? Yeah. It's amazing. The Kaya Hamedam is amazing. Yeah. Yeah. But, but it can also lead you to the highest places. Yeah. Right? A person can lead, use his imagination, right? That's why we say when you see the tzaddik, you go to the tzaddikim. You see how, how humble they are. You see the beauty of the tzaddik. So I can imagine, I, I want to be like that too. I want to also learn. Why can't I also learn? Why I can't? I can do the same thing, right? Yeah. So, the, and imagine, imagine in the right direction, right? How are you thinking you need that? It's a no, problem. I was going to say that my imagination in Uman uh, this year, uh, in, like, <coughs> waking up at this hour, was that that was the imagination. It's like I can do this. Like, uh-huh. I get up at six thirty in the morning, like I've never done before. Wow. In the last like five years, uh, you know. So that imagination pushed me. Wow! Look at it. it's, a, it's really amazing. It's a, it's really amazing, right? It's amazing, right? People people say that they can they go to sleep and they're imagining, you know, they think they can't sleep. Right? <coughs> Someone there's something exciting the next day, right? Right? They have an exciting thing that they're expecting the next day. They can't sleep because they're just imagining what's going to happen, right? They're imagining it. It's, a, it's amazing. Yeah. The Rebbe really gives us the, all the advice that we need in life. Unbelievable. It's all here. <laughs> but he doesn't have a TV set. He doesn't have what? A TV set. No TV in his house. Yeah, you don't, I mean, you it's don't a big need joke a t- about I can't be uh, really religious because then I couldn't have a TV. Okay. I don't get that, but okay. What, what is no, that? I mean, you mean the guy wants to have a TV so he can't be really religious? No, what I'm saying is, is that um, a lot of <clears throat> Americans, if you said you, they couldn't have a TV, yeah, we're, we're, it's kind of like a phone today. We're attached to our phones. We've been, it's like being attached to something physical. Okay. So it's like, uh, okay. it used to be like, when you do, why, why, why then you, you, why do you use something that animals eat? Because the person acted like the animal. He did something. He did something on impulse, instinct, right? He had an instinct, an impulse, right? Animals do things on impulse, right? Right? An animal doesn't think. Right, an animal sees something and he it just does it. He doesn't think what the repercussion is going to be. Right? We have to think. And because we use we did something in that foolish way, like an animal does, so therefore we use the Michael Bahama, right? The animal food, right? <laughs> the Koyan. That would wave it in the in the on, in the holiest place, right? 
the holiest place, the base of Migdash, La Hashem Yisbarach, B'Shisha Kitzavos, in the six directions, right? Up and down, in the four directions, right? You know, north, east, west, south, right? The four directions. K'day lo haidiya sh'akol Hashem Yisbarach. It's all Hashem. It's all you, Hashem. And behind, whatever's going on, it's really going on because it's Hashem. Shezeo bechinas dalid de'echad. Now, like we just I told you before, that's the dalid de'echad. We connect to that every time we say Shema, right? We say the dalid. We said yesterday the dalid is the dalid rabasi, right? The big, the big dalid. Remember, remember the big dalid in the Torah of the of echad. The dalid is the big dalid. Why is that the big dollar? Because Hashem is big and in the four directions. <laughs> He's everywhere. Hashem is everywhere. That's why the dollar is big. Right? The dollar de achot. Shesham mamlichin oisa yizbarach bechol shitra kitzavos. In that place we can be mamlich Hashem in all six directions. In all the six directions. How do you have the six directions? Because the, the dollar is four. But we said in the echot. Right in the ches, in the ches is the seven firmaments up on high, and this world down here. So that's the six directions, okay? Four directions, and then the ches gives you the seven firmaments, and this world, that gives you eight, right? The numerical value of ches is eight, right? Seven firmaments on high, this world is eight, got it? So up and down, the dalid is the four directions, okay? Uh, any questions on this? This is pretty amazing, right? Yeah, yeah. You can only be Ma'ira people that fell down to this low place, to the lowest, lowest places. Even to the Isha Metzah, Isha, the Metzach Isha Zayna, that these low, low, low places, how are you going to help them? Only through Pidyon. If you can attach your Tfilas to that place of Pidyon, then you can daven for those people from that high place, from that place, then you can help all these people. We said that we said that we said that Chum, right? Chum, Chum, right? Chum is also forty-eight. Remember we said that yesterday. Chum, right? Chum is is the is a mem and a ches is forty-eight. Chum is the opposite of the forty-eight kinyanim of Torah. Chum is the other side. Right, that's that's where Mitzrayim comes from. Mitzrayim comes from Cham. Remember, okay. I'm just trying. We're just trying. You remember, okay, okay. Mayach v'das bechinas kedushas kabbalah satayra to get us to the idea to the, uh, of kabbalah satayra. We have a few more minutes. We can finish. Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Bechol zeh muvan betayra es ha'ovin tivasi lekutei maran and tinyana lesson lesson four. Shenemra Bishruas, that it was, that the, the Rebbe said that Torah over, uh, there was actually, it was, uh, what? Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. This, so that's what this whole idea is. We're learning about Shruas, right? We're learning about Shruas. Shazer Shoyrich, Chachma Sateva, Shetrichin, Lachniyoy, Ayadei Tzedaka. Here we go. How do you, how are you, Machniya, the Chachma Sateva? How do you, the Chachma Sateva? Right? How are you, how are you, how are you able to, what, you, you have the plays? How are you able to be mamtik? How are you able to fix the damage that they make in the world by you giving tzedakah? This week's parsha, right? Truma, right? Giving tzedakah, right? Everyone has to give the machzus hashekel. See that? Isn't that beautiful? How it's always connected. It's unbelievable, right? The whole parsha starts off with the machzus hashekel. Everyone has to give a half a shekel. Give truma. Give tzedakah, right? Give give charity. Why show show again when I give charity? That's my greatest de- demonstration. And I'm taking from my will, my will is I should have more money so I can have, I can buy more food, right? You say I can have more money in my bank account. I can, I can have, I can, uh, it's all about money, right? But when I could take my money away and I give my money away, why do I give it away? Because I'm giving it away because Hashem asked and told me to give it the mitzvah of tzedakah. So when I give it away, I'm demonstrating that I'm connecting my rutzen to the rutzen Hashem. Isn't that beautiful? Right? My will to the Ratzon Hashem. Shahidei zeh mesakin pigam hazekenim me arche yomim shebador she'en lahem shleimus. Right? We have all those guys, right? The other guys that have no shleimus. Right? The guys that are, you know, all the professors out there <laughs> that, that are not the, not, not the righteous professors, right? 
All of the guys that are there, there must be a couple of good ones, right? We had Rabbi Tversky, right? He was a great guy, right? He was a professor. We're not talking about him. Right? We're talking about the other guys, right? right? He was also a professor, right? But he was a professor on the other side, on the good side, <coughs> right? All the other ones are professing that, you know, uh, 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 all of the nonsense, okay? And we don't have to talk about it. right? We're taking, we, we, we're, getting, we're getting rid of the Metzach HaNochash, the other side, and we're elevating Ki Adam Sarach Kol Yemei Chayev Lohoisip Bechol Yom Kedush Vedas. Every day in your life, we have to be adding, we have to be adding a little more sanctity, a little more das, a little more closeness to Hashem, right? Das means I connect to Hashem, right? That's das, knowing Hashem. What's the main thing to know in the world? That Hashem runs the world, that's the main thing. That's what we keep saying every day. We keep saying a hundred brachas, right? Right, the same way we, I'm not going to say that thing, right, Yossi? <laughs> I don't want to. What what Ravik Miller said, you know, if you say that word every day a hundred times, you'll remember you'll remember you remember that word, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna say the word. No, the crazy this Rebbe, this guy, he actually did have big ears. Oh milk. Who? Oh. No, the yeah. he actually did have big ears. I mean like like I, I like like I understood, just fuck. I understood what the kids were talking about. Like you even all the yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's the main Ariches Yavim. A guy can come up to Shemayim after, after he, could, he, he could have lived a full life. Let's say he lived a life of 120 years, right? A, a real full life, right? They come up to Shemayim, they say, wow, you're still a little, you're, 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 a, you're an infant. You're a little baby. And they say, what do you mean? Uh, I was, uh, uh, I was, uh, I was, uh, you know, uh, I lived, I lived a whole full life. Uh, I, I ate my meals and I did. Uh, so what they said, every animal does that too. They eat their meals too. What, what, what do you do? If we don't add Kedusha, if we don't add it, 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 Hashem into our day, when we add Hashem into our day, that is actually how, that, that, is, that is actually how we are adding le- light, we, we are having our riches yamim. We're lengthening our day, we're making our time count. It becomes eternal, right? Whenever we turn to Hashem during the day, those moments are the moments that count, right? Those are the moments that count. Anytime I'm learning, I'm davening, I'm talking to Hashem, I'm connected to Hashem, right? I'm thinking of Hashem. Those are the moments that count in my riches yamim, right? That's what... The, you understand? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I and Sham hate them. Okay. The call there. The Chinas has Svirish as Saifim, Hayamim Laimer, Shayadeze, Mamshikim, the Chol Yom, the Yom, Mayak, the Seichel Kodesh Miyuka. We take something special of the day. We, we learn, right? How do you do that? Every day, you have a different situation going on in your life, right? No, no, no two days are the same, right? There are different things going on every day. <coughs> and if you take those things that are going on every day and you connect all those things to Hashem, that's the unique thing of the day. That's how you're supposed to connect to Hashem that day, right? However, whatever is going on that day, connect to Hashem that way. So that way you're constantly connecting Hashem in a unique way because this day is unique. It's not going to happen again, Right? It's not going to happen again. This day is a unique day. It's special today. And it's not going to repeat itself. It's going to be a new day. So every day you can do that again. Miyuchot, right? Something special. You, special. Okay. Kemavaya hate the Kavonis Arizal. This is the teaching in Arizal. Okay. Aval Kol Koya Chazer. Moshe like we learned again, Rav Nasser really wants us to understand this concept, right? This is a concept. This is a concept. One say this is a concept that 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 that, 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 that Rabbi Nachman was very big on, but it's not his concept. This concept was taught by the Arizal. This concept is found in the Zayir Kaddish. Okay, Rabbi Nachman is just bringing it down. He brings it down to us so we can understand it on our level. Of nothing brings it down even lower, right? He brings it down so we can understand it. We're, try- we're, we're trying to understand it, right? But the whole idea that Moshe stays, what? You want to say something? No, 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 no. Moshe is staying from, Moshe Rabbeinu is buried, uh, 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 right? For, uh, 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 opposite the Baal Pa'ar, right? Every time the Baal Pa'ar tries to rear its, uh, its, its head, Maishu Rabbeinu tries to keep it in check. You understand? That's what. That's why he's there. Maishu Rabbeinu is keeping him in check. 
right? And and Moshe Rabbeinu is staying be shmad lerotzen, right? Moshe Rabbeinu is, is we said shmad is three forty four. Moshe is three forty five, right? Moshe is three forty five. Rotzon is three forty six, right? Isn't that cool? All these things, right? They're very close, right? One, uh, just just one away, right? Because the Moshe we said Moshe, U Moshe, it was Mashu. Just a small difference. You can always come back to Hashem no matter where we are. As long as you connect to Ratzah, right? You have to connect to that place of Pidyon. Shemala Mizumas Mitzrayim, Shoyim Aleim Kfirois Uznus, right? The whole Mitzrayim was about Kfira, right? A heresy, right? Moshe Rabbeinu came to Paro and he said, uh, Hashem said to let the people out. Who's Hashem? Right? They had the big telephone book of all their, uh, of all their gods. Remember the telephone books? Do you remember those things, right? Yeah, it's a big, they don't have them anymore, right? <laughs> right? The white pages, the yellow pages, right? Those thick books, right? <laughs> huh? Yeah. They, they still have it? Yeah, I never saw you saw one here, yeah? It's like a Haredi. Yeah, yeah, but then no, they, so, so, so they said they looked up, they, they couldn't find Hashem in there. They had so much kfira, and all the gods, right? That Yisro was, again was the was the was the priest of all of those gods in that whole book. You believe that? The Yisro said, and Yisro said, "Ati adati ki gadol Hashem." Now he know Yisro knew that, right? That was Moshe Rabbeinu's effect that he took the 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 the, the priest of all of that avodas are, and he could say. Right? I know how great Hashem is because he saw, he knew all the other th- n- nonsense gods. Unbelievable. She calls there bechina shmad laalais misham lebechina shrotzen to bring us up to rotzen. Isn't that an amazing idea? This whole lesson. So again, here just to re- re- recap the lesson. Any time you want to daven for somebody, someone is far away. What's the idea? You have to connect to you have to connect to the to the rotzen elia. If you connect to the Rots and Elyon, that's where Pidyon comes from. And that's where you can, you can dive into that person through the Tzaddik. If you could do it yourself, great. If you can go through the Tzaddikim, that's wonderful. However you want to do it. Why? Because the Tzaddikim are tr- constantly working on bringing us back from Shmad Lerotzen, right? Shmad Lerotzen. They try to bring us back. Anytime, anytime we do something contrary to what Hashem wants, right? Hashem says, do this and this. I decide I'm going to do something else, that's for sure, right? So if I did that, if I did that, then I did something contrary to Hashem. That's a, an aspect of Avodah right? Destruction, right? Like we said, Shmat, right? Destruction, I'm, destru- I'm destroying my Nisham, right? That's destruction, right? But if I turn back, if I turn back to Hashem, if I turn back to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, then it went through Pidyan, then I can make the, I can make the rectification, right? We have to go from Shmad Lerotzen. Let us all be zeicher to do this, and we all know people that need tefillas, right? We all know people, right? Right? We may have people in our families that need this, right? So let us all understand this concept. We can daven. How do we daven? We connect the pidyon. How do we connect the pidyon? Shema Yisrael Hashem Elakeinu Hashem Echad. Why Echad? It's the main thing, like we learned, is the dalit of the yachad, the four directions. And we said the ches is the up and down, up and down. If we recognize that Hashem is behind everything, Hashem is controlling everything, and that's and then that that means he tra- it means he's higher than the twenty four court houses where the din comes from that the person brought upon himself because he did the things wrong, right? Then he brought din upon himself. But if I can connect to Hashem. Hashem is in charge of the judges, and I can get my pidyon to get right through the courthouse and get whatever Yeshua that I need. Right? All right, everyone. So, and oh, that, oh you get that the greatest way to do that is through tzedakah. Right? Right. Give money to uh, BRI. Rabbi Rabbi Kramer needs money to print books. Okay, everyone. Call to. <laughs> Have a good Shabbos.